Happy Friday! On my way to see the doctor. There's something about going to the doctor that just makes you nervous. Like I know he's just probably gonna take my stitches out and that's it, but I just get all nervous. Like he's gonna give me like a tetanus shot or something. <laughs> all right, my stitches are out. So we're celebrating the going to Target. Okay, so remember the other day when I said my mom steam cleaned our carpets because the with the windows open, they're always so dirty. Well, she used, I have this little, it's kind of a cheap steam cleaner. It's a Hoover, but it's it's not the best. And it's pretty old, so it's not like picking up the water that it spits out as well. So she decided that that wasn't good enough. So she rented one from Lowe's and is doing it all over again. Hopefully this time it's good. Nice and clean. Ooh, look at that carpet. This is kind of gross, but this is the dirty water that came from the carpet. See, that looks like poop, but it's not. It's just dirty water. Ew, that was in our carpet. Ew, that's so gross. Yeah, happy Friday, happy weekend. Woo! All right, I'm excited. Work was pretty fun today because we were just passing around all that video we recorded last night at the game uh we ended up having three different camera angles first base side third base side and then the home plate and the video turned out awesome and it was a uh, it was a lot of fun to watch it was uh it was pretty cool so we were all just like watching highlights of each other and funny stuff that happened and watching injuries because everybody seemed to be getting hurt last night yeah this morning was probably not as productive as we could have been but you know, whatever, we had a big win. This is the department's talking about the big softball victory. That's what you do, right? So yes, it's the, it is officially my weekend. So I'm excited. I'm gonna head home, uh, see what uh, Chelsea and, and her mom have planned. Probably not a whole lot. Chelsea, I think is still, I think she got a little worn out yesterday from, from her activities. So probably won't be a super fun packed weekend, but hopefully it'll be nice and relaxing. So I'm heading home and let's get this party started. Lucas is home. Boom. Well, not really. Oh yeah, we're not home, we're are not we? Home. <laughs> that was kind of a funny comment. Anyways, we are on our way to Costco. Not our normal Costco though, a different Costco. Because I am on a hunt. I like hunts for some reason. <laughs> ketchup? <laughs> no. Hunts ketchup? No, mustard. I like Hunt's ketchup. Mustard. No, Hunt's doesn't make mustard. Yes, they do. There's been like commercials all Nobody over. Nobody makes TV mustard. And internet and mustard that. is a myth. Is that Hunt's? I don't know. But I yeah. Think, yeah. Mustard. That might be Heinz, actually. Oh, yeah. Heinz. That's what it is. Heinz mustard. Anyways, I'm on the hunt for. And this is all your family's fault, Lucas. Why? All your family's fault. My family's fault? Well, that we have to go to Costco? Yeah. My family doesn't even have Costco. Your extended family's oh. fault. Oh. Because we were at that wedding for his cousin and they had this like caramel popcorn stuff. And it was so good. And they sell it at Costco, but they don't sell it at our Costco that we normally go to. So now I'm on a hunt to find this popcorn. And I searched on Amazon and they want $15 for one bag. What? Yeah. That's I, crazy stupid. That can't be right. I didn't tell you that? No. Yeah, no, it is right. And everyone like in the comments like uh, for the product was like, that's stupid. Go to Costco. So I'm going to Costco. All right, fingers crossed. All right, we made it to Costco. And this one is already 10 times better than the one we normally go to because I found a parking spot in the first 30 seconds of being in the parking lot. Usually it takes me like 10 minutes driving around. So I'm in favor of this one. You? Yeah. Me. I don't think she's having any luck. No luck? No. No, no. I don't think they have it. So we've been walking around for a while now. And I'm old. I am really sore from yesterday. Like my legs hurt, my body hurts. Oh, I can't handle this getting old. It feels like like if, as soon as I hit 30, it was just like, bam, 
damn, you're old, sucker. Your body ain't gonna work no more. Lucas, Lucas, look. Lucas, look. Hey, Lucas. Hey, Lucas. Lucas hey, Lucas. Look. Hey, Lucas. It's candy, but it's like, it's like spice. It's like sweet and sour mango flavored powder. It's a big deal around here. I've never had it. Hey, Have you had it? Hey, no, I haven't. No. No. I'm told it's good, but nah, not for me. And I'm pretty sure Costco got rid of my big jar of jalapenos. Costco's letting me down. I'm sorry, babe. I'm very upset. I'm gonna go cry. Well, I'm gonna find their couches and take a nap. Spoke too soon. This is why you never get too negative about anything. I'm going to give you guys a demonstration on how to use a stud finder. Ready? Yep. Nothing. Nothing. You're welcome. Thanks. Look what I happen to find in the parking lot of Costco. There's a Dollar Tree right here. One that I've never been to. So excited. I bet everything is going to be totally different in there. Probably. It's, it's going to have amazing things. Yep. Like, great, amazing things. All I care about is one thing. What? Dinosaur hat. What else would I care about at Dollar Tree? I don't know, like pins. Oh, well that's or... true. I do love <laughs> looking at Dollar Tree pins. He found his hat. Success! Randomly. They didn't... Oh, here's one too. Yo, the elastic's broken. It's never random. Oh. It was in like a box of stuff. But I knew where it was. You have this like magnetic connection to it? Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. I have a magnetic connection to tiaras. You've never, ever, ever <laughs> worn a tiara in here. It was the first time for everything. I can't get it. It's because I think... They come attached with a wand. Oh, cool, the wand. So it has to dangle off of your head. How does it look? Well, you can't see it. Oh. There you go. Yay. Looks, oh, looks great. Thanks. Found it. Your hunt is over. No, wrong hunt. But it's ketchup. No. You know this is the only condiment Jesus uses. Seriously. Alright. <sighs> We're taking Bozzy out as a family again. It's been so long since we've done this. Yay. All three of us together again. So exciting. Bozzy's super excited. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Water. Bozzy, you're gonna Water. do it. We are a sad bunch tonight. He keeps yawning, then I yawn, then he yawns, then I yawn. I'm sure Bozzy's yawning. It's just been a tiring week. I don't know why. Really? Yeah. Because, I mean, like, coming into this week, even though the the weekend was mired in sadness and bummertude, <laughs> it was still really relaxing. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Yeah. Um, I mean, there, we didn't really like get too crazy. I mean, it was lots of rest and just kind of hanging out. And so I figured, like, coming into this week, it was just going to be, you know, going to be well rested. And this whole week, I don't know, man. It's just been exhausting. Were you, like, was it like that for you? I wouldn't say I had a mentally exhausting week. I don't know. It was a lot of doing nothing this week. Yeah. I did get breakfast in bed every day thanks to my mommy. It was very, very nice. And our bed got coffee. <laughs> when was that, yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, it was yesterday. Okay, because I have this like tray that I've been using for my breakfast in bed. And I had my like half drunk, is that a word, half drunk cup? of coffee yeah. still sitting on that tray. Well, like I got up to go to the bathroom or something and then like crawled back in bed not really thinking and uh, obviously the tray isn't very like sturdy on a bed. 
like it probably should be. But anyways, the whole cup of coffee spilt all over the bed. It was a mess. We cleaned it though. We did the laundry. Who's we? I didn't. My mom. Well, my mom did. <laughs> point to me, I didn't do anything. <laughs> because there's not, like, I love coffee and I love the smell of coffee, but there's nothing worse than like dried coffee on like clothes or like blankets or something. It smells really bad. I, I mean, I don't really like the smell of coffee. <gasps> I know, I know, I know. I just, there's just something about coffee. Like, I, I don't like it. Most food that I don't like, I don't like the smell of either. Really? I feel like my sense of smell and my sense of taste are very closely tied. <laughs> like if I don't like the way something smells, I am not going to like the way it tastes. And I can't that makes sense. I can't really think of anything that I like to eat that I don't think smells good. Um, let's see. Like that's what I that's me. what I don't understand like about that. Fish? Uh, I don't like the smell of fish, but like some fish, if it's too too fishy or too, I don't know. I I don't I don't like it. Yeah, that's what I don't understand about like that. Uh, what is it, Limburger cheese? Yeah. That really stinky cheese, but people like to eat it. I I don't know how you do that. I can't eat something that I think smells bad. Yeah, I get it. But coffee smells so good. Like you walk into a coffee house, you don't like that smell? I mean, it doesn't smell, I guess it doesn't smell bad. I just don't, it clearly does not have the same, uh, it doesn't do the same thing for me as it does for you. I, I just. It does a whole bunch of things for me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I'm oh. just not. Uh, You're gonna get wet. You're gonna get wet. Nah. You're gonna get wet. You're gonna get wet. Buzzies too. Oh, you're gonna get oh, wet. Yeah. Gonna get wet. <laughs> Come on, man, watch out. Buzzy, you're gonna get wet. Anyways, we better go inside before we get wet. So, well, thanks for watching, guys, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye bye.